Oh, a pike just grabbed him. A pike just grabbed him from Hey, it's Ty and welcome to another episode of Get the Gaff Outdoors. Thank you guys so much for tuning in today to the fourth episode of Rand and I's trip up here in the Boundary Waters up here in Northeast Minnesota. We're just packing up the canoe right now. We got a little bit of a late start, but that's all right. Uh, caught a couple pike from the bank this morning, but we're about to go into a small bay, protected from the wind a little bit, and cast for a lot of pike, see what we can catch. Maybe hopefully then get into a couple walleyes that we can eat for lunch. If you guys haven't seen the third episode yet um, of our Boundary water series make sure you tune in that one uh, i'll have a link down there in the description in that video you can see a giant pike that we caught a lot of big ones uh, that we threw back a lot of fun so make sure you check that out hopefully we're going to do the same thing today but i'll quit blabbing see you guys out there we're out in the water it might be a small mile it is a small mile out of the water. Yeah, it's a small mall. Came out of the water for pike fishing with the freaking daredevil. I say it hit pretty close to the boat. Jeez! Definitely not fighting like a pike. Jeez. It's nice. Ah, jeez. It's actually a nice small. It's the second smallie up here I've caught on a spoon. Got the hook out. It was underneath of his chin, which is fun. But got it, got him. There you go, buddy. All right, we'll keep casting. Got a real fast because we're coming at him. But you might have to paddle. Oh, I hooked a pike in the top of the head. <laughs> I'm sure he took a whack at it. There you go, buddy. 45. Yeah, this is fun. We tried to get to our next spot, and um, yeah, we're gonna be we're gonna be stuck here for a little while. The wind is ripping all the way across the lake. White caps everywhere. We're actually in the break of this island right now, and it's still really brutal. Murr's getting scared. <laughs> All right, she says she's not scared. That's good. Well, we're probably going to be here a while, so might as well get comfy. Oh, this is cool. Be a good place to have a shore lunch. <laughs> Walleye. Yep. On the twisty tail. Oh, don't drop him down that crack. He'll get away. Uh, yeah, there's Nice, dude. He just absolutely hammered it. Heck, yeah. On a normal day, what? On a normal day? There you go, bud. <laughs> what is it? Smalley or Walter? Little small, <laughs> easy. <laughs> yeah, there he goes. <laughs> he left you with two pieces of two old leeches. <laughs> How about that? Did you see that? No, I didn't. He jumped. He did a backflip. That was unbelievable. He might be an eater, Mur. Is he a little small to eat? I think he's a... I think it's a good eater size, don't you? Probably more better for me anyway. There you go. All right. You get to be part of lunch, buddy. Thanks for playing. Really yep, something grabbed it. Is 
Is it also a smallmouth? It is a little smallmouth. Trying to steal all of our bait. God, he's angry. Look, he, all right, back you go, bud. I'll take some of that. Oh, got him. Good fish. Yep, want the net. Good smallie. Whoa, good smallie. Look at that chunk. That's the biggest smallie I think we've caught so far. kept one today ah. well after we dropped you like oh, no. after you, we dropped you like that we're definitely keeping you all right all right all right all right we'll put you out of your misery nice though another smallie Ooh. over here big boy oh he's puking up all sorts of stuff oh and there he goes he heard me say already that that was the only small mouth we were keeping Ugh. all right time for another leech small oh i'm in your way you got him nice yeah, he's a keeper. Well done. Conveniently right when those guys turned around. <laughs> well done, honey. On the twisty. Another decent small egg. should have asked for help but I got it got him Ugh. nice fish nice fish Ugh. he could be our third fish for supper I kind of want a walleye though Yeah, this one got munched on by a pike. Ouch. That hurt. Oh, both sides. Look at that. Grody. We ain't eating you, bud. There you go. Got that one. Ah, you flipped. Don't flip off my leech. off my leech. Already flipped it off. You goof. There's a crawfish I was trying to get, but he ain't giving it back. Alright, you keep it. Go ahead. Go ahead. Uh, down, bobber, down, bobber, down, bobber, down. Got this one. The thing is, I know it's another small leech. No, this is a walleye, 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 wal
lost him. There goes my leech. But we got the walleye. <laughs> oh, that's good stuff. Good stuff. All right, there we go. That is enough fish for dinner. A Rocco, two walleyes, and a small jaw. Ooh. I got Barry. Good eye, Mer. Oh, good smallie. Good smallie. Good smallie. Shout out to Mer. Dude, that's big. That's good. Those are good runs. My track's pretty tight. I, I think I might need help. I think I want to land this one. Broke him off. Broke him off. Broke him off on the rocks. My braid touched the rocks. Broke him off. That was good fish. Oh, I need to try to get my bobber. I got a tangle up in the front of my rod. I just hand lined when I took the bobber. A little, a little small mouth. Oh, a pike just grabbed him. A pike just grabbed him from up. Oh, a pike just grabbed him. A pike just grabbed him from up. Dude, did you guys see that? A pike just grabbed him from right next to me. There's a pike sitting right next to me this whole time. Oh, I'm gonna net him. I'm gonna net him. I'm gonna hand line him and I'm gonna net him. Oh, he let go. <laughs> he let go right as I was about to net him. I just hand lined in a pike that took a small mouth. <laughs> he would have been a keeper size. <laughs> he was sitting right here and he, I got the fish right here and he came out and smoked it. Still got my leech, which is good. But look at that. That's where that pike just smoked. <laughs> Poor little guy. All right, get out of here. Good fish. He, f ah, he stood my bobber up. And then I was like, oh, I think that was a bite. We're gonna flip this one because I think we're gonna try and eat him. Rod up, learn from last time. Uh oh. Oh, I hooked my rain jacket. Yeah. Yeah. Want to eat him? All right. That's all the fish we need. It is a fat one. Two will taste good. It's just its gill. It's like it on both sides. All right, we got more fish that she wanted. We can feed her. All right, time for dinner. Hey you guys, thank you so much for tuning into this episode of Get the Gaff Outdoors. Sorry kind of for the abrupt ending. Had a lot of footage for some reason get lost on this trip. Had some camera issues, had some memory card issues, but was gonna clean up those smallmouth and those walleyes and show you guys, but that didn't happen. No big deal. Thanks for watching the fourth episode of our trip here. Like I said, we caught a lot of walleyes. We caught a ton of smallmouth on this day. Lost a giant, but also ate a couple. And man, I tell you what, they still eat up pretty freaking good. Like I said before, thanks so much for watching. If you did like this video, you wanna see more like it, make sure you leave a comment, let me know what you thought, leave a like, hit that subscribe button down below. Let's me know that you guys wanna see more videos just like this one. But I will see you guys next time we're on the water chasing the next giant. Woo!